Basin here, and welcome back to another episode of Darkest Dungeon. Uh, we just completed our first real mission here, and uh, we're ready to go on to a second one. Uh, let's see what we got. You always want to check your stagecoach to see who's coming in to join your party. Man at arms are the awesome. The raw strength of youth may be spent, but his eyes hold the secrets of a hundred campaigns. And bounty hunters actually do crap to the damage. The thrill of the hunt. The promise of payment. Alright, so now I'm going to demonstrate what these things are for. These are another form of currency besides your gold. This is how you upgrade your state. Uh, one of the first things you should do is increase the number of heroes that you get back here. Because since it's a roadlike, you are pretty much guaranteed you're going to lose people. Uh, Word no, getting is attached traveling. to people hurts. Ambition is stirring in distant cities. We can use this. Alright, I'm gonna save this roster size one until I actually need it. Uh, but there's nothing else to demonstrate right now, so what you do is you come to a new area. My healer has a lot of stress. I don't like that. Kinda wish I got another healer. What position do you wanna be in? One, two, three, one, two. He has bleeds, doesn't he? Yeah. He doesn't have a mark. It's the tough part about all this is your people always come in with random skills and stuff, so you can get really screwed over. You get bad rolls. See, I have no heals. I have no heals. a medium length Doesn't that give me don't care give me got a chance it's actually kind of nice the short might take that one nope nope yeah we're gonna do a short dungeon increase scouting chance i may have to <sighs> i don't want to chance this without a healer where his skills Oh man, he just got the buff boss skills. He is worthless. And he's ruins foe. This guy is not good. Dang it. Got a bad man at arms. Ooh. He is nasty. Oh, that's a good one. Ooh. That's rough though. Dang it. I'm gonna have to chance it. I have to bring her. We just get screwed over by everyone dying. I just have to, uh, part over the new estate. Yeah, we're gonna need some. Those, those, those. Those. I think herbs are actually kind of useful. Get an alchemy table or something. If I bring 18 food. I may be able to get away with not breaking a pistol. Because you gotta think future too, is if I bring a vessel now and she gets stressed and I don't get another healer next run, I'm super screwed. Although, because this run actually might be doable without a vessel, I think I'm gonna chance it. Because she needs to heal that up, especially if I get bad rolls next run. Bring all the food. Eight torches. Two of those. One of those. One of those. One of those. I'm gonna bring two of those. Just because we might get some extra bleeders, and since we have no vestal, we need. 
need to make sure people aren't bleeding the out. The must be driven back. And what better place to begin than the seat of our noble line? So you notice, to you complete this mission, it's 100% of room battles. And look, this actually might be a room battle, so you have to go check it out. Never touch books. Oh god, ambushed by oh, look how invention. stressed he is now. If you watch, uh, Wealth beyond Bear measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Bear Taffy on YouTube, one of my favorite YouTubers. Uh, he plays this game a lot, he's actually pretty good at it. And man, he has some amazing bear luck, but... Go-to phrase of his is, uh, fuck books! And yeah, stand by it, man. Books will ruin you. Feeling less of this confident. Ooh, man. Already? Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. Don't steal stuff. Thank you. And it doesn't matter if you have them selected or not. Um, it's just a chance that his court goes off. Man, who's the fat ass? We're gonna keep our torch up a little bit. We're not gonna be trying to look for crazy loot this run. We're looking to actually just complete the mission and get out. Really? Dang it. Carelessness will find no clemency in this place. I think if I send him... Do I want to send him or... Tater, we're gonna send... Actually, I think Plague Doctor's our female, so we're gonna send her to the confession booth. I think... I did not... No. I meant to send her. The Plague Doctor. That would've healed her stress. Oh, I misclicked. Oh boy. Oh, oops, I meant to. This. Oh, thank God there was no fight. Dang it. I missed out on the opportunity to heal her stress. Who's the fat ass? I'm gonna eat all my freaking food. A handsome reward. Crap, I'm For a still. Task well performed. Healing over not being able to heal her stress. Alright, thanks for the scout. I got a fight, two curios, and a fight with the curio. Alright. Don't don't be something useful. Thank god nothing was in it. I'm in. So I think this is actually one of the uh mobs, or whatever the mod I have adds. I think my buddy was watching me play and he said he's never seen that guy before, so we're gonna stun him because I actually forget what he does. But he's special and I don't like special. They hurt you. And I'm gonna try to stop it. Dude, you're missing your stuff. More damage or stun. Oh, dude! Nice. You guys are surprised I just picked up on that. Bounty hunter damage is stunned, that's dope. How much life do you have? Six. You need to just this Thank advantage. You. Give them no quarter. What sucks about the plague doctor is a very small chance that they will ever heal stress from killing something. Another abomination nice, dude. cleansed from our land. Bounty hunter can do great damage. Essentially, he just kind of reset. 
No, he didn't, because he had zero stress when he got healed. Dang it. He does nothing. as the enemy crumbles. Double stun, come on. Nice. Such a oh. terrible assault cannot be Jeez. left unanswered. Like, come on. Light up, surprise them more often. Fuck him for two shot. He's gonna try to kill the spider. Oh, fuck. Dude, I gotta hit those. Another one yeah, double falls. kill. You don't. Thank you. Fiend falls. A faint hope blossoms. There's one more room. Come on. Don't be a nasty room. I would have liked if there was food in there. Heal her up. Heal him up. Max stress her torchlight. Yuck. These guys are also. I believe. Oh man, this actually might end my run. Oh man, this is this is gonna be rough. Double stun. Thank you. We'll see if they both would have just went. Kind of wish they didn't, because he could have jacked him up. Wait a minute. Thanks. I didn't check what his stun resistance was before doing that. God dang it. What's that do? Stun resistant prod. Alright. Six damage a turn. Let's see if he just 
Masterfully executed. Right out. Right, the bleeds were kind of worthless there, but whatever. You're getting stunned again, bro. So if I tried to target him, he would just guard me anyway, so I gotta hit him. Dang it, if I would stun him, it removes the guard. Ouch, don't stun me, thank you. Crap. Uh, did his guard just fail? I've never seen that. That overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Yeah, he can do anything from position three. Right, we need to open this. this. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must now be I have carried home. Out. I have to send someone to the to rest. I wish that devils remanded to their abyss. I suppose I could have taken him to just kept that team buff, but... I do not... I do not play buff bot man at arms well. Though long years may seek to separate them, action and consequence will invariably have their dreadful reunion. Nice, we got another healer. Barbaric rage dope. and unrelenting savagery make for a powerful ally. That is not a healer. This is that new mod class. I've never tried out. I'm gonna have to... Wow. So th this is uh, essentially... Like the fanatic guy that will chase you in the... Crimson Court. Or after you've unlocked him, rather. Interesting. I wonder if she can't be with some people if they have the curse. Antiquarians are good ways to She be searches playing. where others will not go and sees what others will not see. Alright. Gotta click on these. Make no mistake, we will face ever greater threats. Our soldiers must be ready. Now I can at least train people. The bellows skills. blast once again. The forge stands ready to make weapons of war. So I may might cost a crap ton though. Oh, not that one. To reskill him. Yeah, I only have fifteen grand. A strict regimen is paramount if one is to master the brutal arithmetic of combat. I may have to open up the roster just in case it gets screwed. I'm gonna do that. More arrive, foolishly seeking fortune and glory in this domain of the damned. Of weapons, 
in the end, every plan relies upon a strong arm and tempered steel. Now what I'm gonna do is everyone here. See what I can build out. And if I need someone, I'll set them to this stress relief. Ooh, look, I was invited to go check out the courtyard. At least will mess me up. Can't wait till I get a flagellant. It's my favorite class now. Leper is also one of my favorites. Just no good trinkets, man. That's kind of how I'm going to be playing the very beginning of this. Is just what kind of trinkets and stuff I can get to help bolster my team before I even start worrying about upgrading stuff. But I believe I'm at time. Uh, thank you for tuning in. I don't know if I should extend these episodes a little bit longer. I might think about doing that just because actually you're just going to see one run an episode and that sounds kind of ridiculous. But thank you for tuning in. I'm hoping you're liking it. Please remember to like, subscribe, comment if you so desire. But more importantly, remember to spay new to your pets, adopt a shop, donate to a rescue if you can afford it, or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering. That's a very rewarding experience and helps out those rescues and animals that are in need. Uh, but I am Faison. Thank you for tuning in with me, and I'll catch you next time. See ya!